going on doggies and welcome back to another one. So I've got a new fishing game for you guys. I'm gonna roll on them clips a little bit later on, but for now, we just woke up on a part of the island that we've never been on before. Look at this, mate. This is living. So we, me and my chick, we've been driving around for the last three days on the bike. We've been doing little trips around the island, getting footage, flying the drone, just living the dream. So I'll roll some of them drone clips on now and then I will show you guys the new fishing game. Woo! So it's been an epic couple of days. We've been driving around on the scooter, like I said, just filming, exploring, doing the things we love. It's so good just to get out and explore. We love it. So I went fishing a couple of days ago and I had a squid session, the best squid session I've ever had. I caught my personal best squid. It's a donkey. So I'm gonna roll them clips on now. And then after squid fishing, I'll see you guys back at my house and we'll cook up one of the best squid recipes ever. It's like a new way I cook squid and it is so good. So stick around for that and enjoy the um, squid session. Yeah, doggies. We got a fish on. As soon as that sun come up, boom, I got a squid. Why is it not me? Why is it not me? Oh, the captain's got one. I've got one. Why is it not me? Come on, brother. This is our second drop of the morning. We haven't been here for long at all. Look at the noodle rod bend, man. All right, we need the net. Oh, he's coming. Yeah! First drop, that was so sick. I changed my lure and boost. I've got a first squid for the day. Baby! <laughs> so that is a tiny little cuttlefish. It's probably the smallest cuttlefish I've ever seen. <laughs> it's the third drop in our third spot. So it's two for three right now. That's killer. Yeah, that's what we come for. Yo! Loose. Good job. Thank you. Hey, my first one. First one for the day. Get him. There it is. Oh, that's a good one. That was close. Yeah, that's a good one. That thing is beautiful in the light. Pink, pinky. You did it. Good job. Yeah. And the captain's on again. Nah. This ain't happening. Come on. So I want to start a new fishing game and it's going to be called Squid Nuts. So all this game requires is a squid and a big set of nuts because oh, I'll catch a squid and I'll show you the game. It's gonna be interesting, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> oh, there's so many squids. We just had a three-way hookup. You lost yours? Yes. All right, me and the captain have still got ours. I've got a baby one on. Oh. 
So there we go. There's a little one I just got. And the captain's got a donkey down the back there. Oh, he's got one on. So what the game is, it's called squid nuts. You need a squid and you need a big set of nuts. Every time you catch a squid, you've got to hold it at your face for five seconds. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, I got away with it. It's like, it's like playing Russian roulette with squid. I'm going to get shot in the face by one of these soon. Oh, it's another good one. Yeah. Woo! One tap. <laughs> it's all happening here. Bagus. Come on. Oh, this is my biggest squid yet. Come to Papa. Yes. So that's my best squid yet. We got one. How beautiful are the colours in this thing? Sick. All right, quick game of squid nuts, ready? One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> it's like convulsing, it's ready to squirt. There we go, that's our squid. Epic. I wanna get shot in the face by one now, it's gotta happen sooner or later. Come on, hit me. Next one, I'm gonna step it up. 10 seconds squid nut challenge. Oh, we're going down for another drop. So I played this game Squid Nuts back in Australia. It's so funny. There's a video on my Instagram of where we hold the squid and these squid are not shooting. I don't know why, but within five seconds, the squid in Australia would just buff up. Is it? Buff us in the face and it was just, it's the funniest thing to see someone get hit. So um, we'll see if we can do, get these squid to do it, but they're not doing it. I'm going to bring the game back to life. Squid Nuts. Maybe I'll have to do a uh, 10 second countdown instead of five. Don't know. Look at that, mate. This one is the weapon. We're doing good. We're about to move spots next spot. Here we go. I'm on. The boys are both on. Wow, oh, it's a good one. Woo! This is good. Look at this thing, it's peeling. Big one up, cross. Boom. Ooh. That's lovely. Ooh. So that was a sick session. The boys hooked up first and then I hooked up last. All three of us got a squid and they're all about that size. 10 second squid nuts, here we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Ah, this squid is sleeping. It's another triple. Yeah, the boys. We just come up to a new spot and as soon as the squid jig hit the bottom, boom, it was on. This place is on fire. <laughs> Bent rods everywhere you look. Here she comes. Look at that, there's another beautiful one. This is too good. Again, we've got a double hookup. This place is off its head, mate. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah, they got me. Already, <laughs> huh? Well, he got me, but we weren't playing the roulette game. That's a sick one. Beautiful. This is so much fun. And now the captain's on at the back. Put are on. I'm getting in.
got another squid. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> yep, the wind's in. Really, really strange, right? As soon as that wind come in, the squid have gone off the bite. Like, we've been fishing for now an hour and a half now, and um, nothing, we're not getting anything. So we're gonna try one more spot. Hopefully we get a big boy there, but as soon as that wind come in, it just turned off. Really weird. I wanna get a big squid, and I wanna have a crack at this game. Squid nuts. I wanna give it a good shot. If not, I'm gonna go again to another place, and we're gonna have a land-based squid nuts session. But, a little bit rough out here. It probably looks beautiful on the camera, but it's getting a little bit rough and choppy. See if we can get one more. So just rocked up to our last spot. The captain hooked up, I hooked up, lost one. Now I've got another one. Oh, all three of us are on. This is bullshit. Woo! That's a horse. And I lost mine. No! Oh, it's gone. Oh, no, it's gone. Oh, no, no, no. oh that was big. Close. Oh, man, that were two really, really big squid in this last spot. So this is what I'm trying to get shot in the face by. Squid ink. <laughs> All right, so we're on again. We drifted over that. Oh, my God. Look at that thing squirting ink. That's a big squid. Jeez, that's a good squid, dude. Yeah, brother. Oh, look at that. Look at this thing go. There's a real squid now. Last spot of the day. I'm still going with mine. This could be my PB squid right here. This is the best, biggest squid I've ever caught right now. I'm scared I'm gonna lose it. This is psycho. I really don't wanna lose this squid. Ah, look at this. Yeah. Ooh. That is a horse of a squid. Dude. Two kilo. So this thing is by far my personal best squid. Look at the size of this thing. Oh my god. That's big, dude. That thing made the noodle rod absolutely pierce. Like I was, it was taking line. Oh my god, I'm just frothing right now. I'm actually shaking. Biggest squid of my life. I didn't even get to play squid nuts with it, I was way too frothed. Ten points. Oh! Are you guys ready to taste the best squid of your life? Yeah! So before we cook this mouth-watering squid, I'll show you guys around our new pad. We've just moved into a new house, we're still kind of moving in, so we've got shit everywhere, but this place is going to be dope. So here's where we chill when the sun's out. No sun today. Here's our pool. Yeah, it looks pretty sick. We need to show this thing some serious love. Over there, I've got a fish cleaning station. This is our bedroom. This is a sick kitchen. This is where we're gonna make the squid right now. And I'll just quickly show you guys upstairs because this view's killer. Come up here with a coffee in the morning. This is the morning view, this is where we sit, we have a coffee and we just hang out. It's killer. And we got two spare bedrooms, one and two, for whoever wants to come and stay. Whew. All right, let's go make this squid. This is gonna make your mouth water. All right, for this recipe, you're gonna need fresh squid. Check. I use Italian seasoning, bay leaves, whole black pepper, white vinegar, chili, garlic. 
Right, so I originally cut this squid into squid rings, but um, we're not going to use squid rings. What we'll do, we'll cut it into slices like this. And then with a sharp knife, we'll just bust a couple of little lines in it this way, this way, like that. Oh, stop it. You definitely want to put the tentacles in. This is my favorite part of a squid, these things. Oh. No, it'll be all right. All right, so that's all done. All cut up. And this next part is probably the most important part of the procedure. So you want to put the squid into hot water, but not boiling water. That's the secret. It's nearly boiling. So you don't want it to cook. You just want it to start opening. That's perfect. Oh yeah, that's enough. So I've got absolutely no idea when this turned into a cooking channel, but you guys have to try this squid. It's going to make your mouth water, guaranteed. So I'm going to cut up these and then we'll uh, get the party started. All right, it's party time. Chili, garlic, chopped up, jar, squid, ingredients. Let's do this. And my chick just got home, so I'm going to get her to film. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> All right, first things first, we're just gonna stuff this jar with this squid. Look how good this is. It's the best tasting squid you've ever had, eh? It's so yum. It's the best. All right, so we'll put about that much squid in a jar. Italian seasoning. There's no rules when it comes to cooking in this kitchen. All right, we're gonna bang in a bay leaf. I've got no idea what this does or what it tastes like, but it smells good and it made the last one smell pretty good. So we'll put that down the bottom. Chili and garlic. About this many, no, a few more, this many, oh, that's a lot. That's a little bit. Straight in the jar. It's as easy as this. White vinegar to the top. You don't understand how good this tastes. That's it. Give it a shake and put that in the fridge for 24 hours if you can resist 24 hours. All right, so before we went on that trip and we took all that drone footage, I made one of these jars of squid like three days ago. So it's been marinating in the fridge for three days and that's what it looks like. Oh my God, I can't wait to try this. We'll, um, we'll get out of the ugly kitchen. We'll go down into the garden and we'll try this. Are you ready? Look at this. Oh man, it is the, it's probably my favorite way now of cooking squid. You have to try this, it's insane. Without any hesitation, I could smash this whole jar, but it's gonna taste even better with a cold frothy. So I'm gonna go get one and love yous and leave yous. Thank you for watching guys. Much love and I'll uh, see you in the next one. Yeah doggies. Wow. What? Whoa, I just hit myself in the face.